Okay, you're gonna. These are the screws on the front of the machine that need to be loosened in order to get the back off. I'm pointing to it right there. You're gonna need to um, get a crescent wrench or a wrench that fits that and just loosen them. You don't have to take them off. You just have to loosen them and then you pull the side out. And as you can see there, the side has come out. Um, you need to do that on both sides of the machine and then you can loosen the screws on the back. So loosen the Phillips screws, remove those, and then the whole back comes off. You may need to take the top one out too. There you can see the back pulling away from the machine. Once it's off, you'll see that, that the pump is on the left-hand side of the machine if you're looking at it from the back. And facing towards the rear of the machine, this is looking at it towards the rear, from the rear of the machine, you'll see that there is a, there's a, a flathead screw that is inside of a nut. And by turning that clockwise, you increase the pressure. Uh, going or the speed at which the water goes into the uh, into the chamber, and by turning it counterclockwise, you decrease it. I recommend turning this a quarter of a turn and brewing a cup of tea, and then another quarter of a turn and brew a cup of tea. This is on the box that controls the um, the temperature. This should be above that pump apparatus and to the right. It's a black and silver box, and after you pop the yellow cover off of the screw you can see down in there there's a screw that if you turn it towards the plus uh, it increases the temperature and away from it decreases the temperature so I, again I recommend turning it a quarter turn or a little bit and then brewing a cup of tea and then adjusting it accordingly before you put the back back on okay thank you very much if you have any questions please contact me I want to make sure that you have all the information you need